I would like to see schools take better action in helping kids with their mental health and, you know, zero tolerance towards bullying. No, at six, a concerned mother is speaking with CBS 4 News. She tells us her 15-year-old daughter is being bullied at school and nothing is being done to stop it. And those alleged taunts have gone from bad to worse. CBS 4's Joan Murray has the story you will see only on 4. I'm, I'm extremely frustrated. I don't know what it'll take for them to, to do something. This mom who asks us not to show her face is upset and worried about her 15-year-old daughter, who's a student at Mater Lakes Academy. They're not doing anything. She says her daughter has been bullied since school started, and the taunts have turned vicious from boys and girls. He told her that she looked like she could be the school shooter. Then some other kid's girlfriend texted her to go kill herself because she was texting friend stuff. The breaking point happened Monday when her daughter saw this message scrawled on a bathroom wall. The world is better without you. Proud of her that she said something and I don't have to worry about waking up to my kid not being alive anymore. The mom reported it and exchanged text messages with an administrator who assured her it would be removed. And four days later, it's still on the wall. It's unacceptable. Mater is a charter school independent from the Miami-Dade school system. On their web, they say the school is about meaningful achievement of academics, enabling students to become confident, self-directed, and responsible lifelong learners. We went to the school to try to get some answers. We were told the principal was out of the country, the vice principal in a meeting. Later, a spokesperson for the Florida Charter School Alliance called us to say that the school has launched an immediate investigation into the bathroom message and that it was removed but reposted. She said students are being interviewed and bullying is taken seriously. I would like to see schools take better action in helping kids with their mental health and, you know, zero tolerance towards bullying. And we are told whatever the investigation reveals, appropriate disciplinary action will be taken. This mom is only hoping her daughter can get some relief. In Hialeah, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.